Well, there's some very big developments expected in the next few hours about the proposed European Super League. This is JB3, and we are back with another episode of the Super League as we try to take West Ham here in the Super League against the best teams in the world. It's been a struggle lately. We're here into August. Transfer window is still open as we continue along here. We will start the month, though. Real Batiste here on the first, and then we take on Villa Real on the fifth. So it's been a struggle here to try and get things going. The team, we were so close in the last one. We dropped both games on late goals. If we can put it together, though, we're starting to find some offense, starting to gel together as we add players into the team. Let's see if we can get a win here. It's been two months without one. We need to get things turned around quickly. Let's see if we can do it here in the month of August. And so thanks to the fatigue, we have to go through and rotate our entire team. So we're going to go with a brand new formation. It's a 4-4-1-1. I don't know how this is going to work. The team just, I mean, everyone was tired and we just don't really have enough depth still in this team. So Fredericks come in, comes in at left back. Vlasic goes into the midfield with Ben Rama and Bowen takes the camera roll there. Actually, we're going to rotate that through. So we'll switch Bowen and Vlasic. Antonio, the lone man up top with Rafa out on the right side. And we'll get this one underway. Antonio races forward here, has Vlasic and has some help out there on the wide side. Can he put the cross in? It's a long one. Can he get there? Puts it right on the keeper. A great pass there into the box. Unfortunately, keeper gets all the way back over there and makes the save. And it will be a corner here. Rafa tries to send it in. Gets Antonio on a great chance and puts it on his head. Right in between the two defenders. And we have a lead, boys and girls. We got a lead. West Ham or 1-0 up here in the 13th minute. Can we hold on to it and get things started right here in August? Edgar gets the ball in here. Zuma needs to step up long range shot and we let one go again. What do we have to do every single time they get to the top of the box before we can even react? And it goes in every single time. And just like that, we're back even again. Unbelievable, these long range shots are the most irritating thing in FIFA this year. They always go in and they seem so easy to make. Oh, Hinterger has to race back here as the ball gets up here. Good chance there. And it's luckily broken up nicely there by the defensive line. And it's a good chance here. We'll swing it wide. Rafa on the ball. Can he get in there? He has a lot of pace. He's going to get the corner here. Has a chance. Takes the shot. It's going to sit there. Loose ball. And we can't jump on it there. And they will clear it out and actually end up with the possession. Oh, Antonio flips it around here. Has Bowen. Bowen now driving forward. Has Vlasic. He holds up. Slides it along. Antonio, no. Right on the keeper. And he makes the save. Top of the box here. We'll get there. Pressure on right in front. And Ariola tips it away. Luckily, that was a dangerous one. And it goes wide. 1-1 one, one still. They get a good pass there. Top of the box again. And Ariola again gets tall to it. Flicks it wide. Full extension. Corner. Short here. And Rafa keeps it in. He's going to have a chance here to run up the wing. It's Rafa who gets out here. Four nulls running with him. Can we do anything with it? We need to get some men on sides. Rafa holds it up, centers it there nicely, tries to send it through for Antonio and could not get it past the defense. And it will go into halftime, all even at one. Oh, we knocked the ball away with Zuma. They get it right back and it's going to sit right there. Oh, we knocked it away again. A third one. Can we just get the ball cleared? Finally, Zuma heads it out. It will go right back, though, right in the middle. Zuma has to knock it away again. And we'll finally get the ball out of there. 
And we're just going to dump it long here. Rafa, he's going to get on the end of it. He's going to drive in here. He has a chance. He's going to not beat the keeper again. Getting inside of us, the laid off into the middle, top of the box. Can we get in front of it? Zuma, a big block away. We can't hit the pass off though. Zuma has to get down. And this is the most frustrating thing ever. We get, the, we break up the ball every time and we just, no matter how many times we hit the pass button, can't get it cleared. And it's 2-1 as we fall behind again. A good ball there. Has it settled in the midfield now? We'll get a chance here. Can we get something out wide? Swings it around Fredericks. Fredericks now going to drive in here. Looking for the cross. Has Vlasic on the header. Off the keeper. And no matter how well we play, these keepers seem to keep us out. A great chance there. And he's able to flick it over the bar. In the middle here. We'll slip it through. Vlasic has a chance. He puts it in the net and we're level again. There we go. West Ham have some life here. As this game should be close. It should be close. We deserve to get something out of this game. We've played well. We finally get something there. Vlasic gets behind his man. And he puts it in. And it's 2-2. Two -two. And we'll have a chance here. Free kick. We'll try to throw it into the box. It's going to be right there. A chance. Vlasic right there. Zuma right there. Oh, and Zuma, unfortunately, is off sides. A great free kick opportunity. And he was actually in the way of Vlasic putting it home. We'll send it down. It's a good ball to chase. Ben Rama on it. He'll have a chance here. Can he get into the box? Needs a little help. Sends it across. Looking for it. It's headed back in. It's going to be in a dangerous position. And it's headed out in the end. A fall now on the ball. Can he get it to Ben Rama? Ben Rama on a chance. Is the flag going to stay down? He has a chance. Lines it up. And he puts it in. 3-2. Three 3-2 to two. Three to two West Ham. There we go. Maybe it's the 4 one, one Maybe it's the 4 one, one Maybe it's just a little grit. Maybe it's just the players wanting to be better. I don't know what it is. But that is going to be hopefully a result. we got six minutes remaining. And it is going to be 3-2 to two West Ham. Ball gets out wide. Kafal now has a chance. Sends it all. Oh, tried to send it through to Ben Rama to end the game. It will be one last push as we retreat backwards. Trying to help out defensively. It's all the help in the world. Every man back here. Can we get out there? It's broken up. It's picked up here. Can we send it through? No, we'll throw it at him. And it will be a throw in here. One couple minutes remaining. A lot of extra time. Can we get rid of it? No, broken up again. Can we just get this ball long? Zuma on the ball. Boots it long all the way up top. We'll try to flick it on. And that's the game. 3-2 to two West Ham after two months. Finally find a victory. And so we will get into this one. Only a little bit of fatigue still left. So we're going to go back to this 4-1-2-1-2 and see what we can do here. It helped offensively. If we can sure things up defensively, I think we should be all right. We'll set Cresswell and Kafal to stay back while attacking. Rafa with a little bit of fatigue, but he should be able to get the job done. We're back at home. Let's see if we can get a two-game winning streak here against Villarreal. And we'll get this one underway. Ball gets in behind here. Zuma tries to step out. Good job by Hinterger. Breaks it up in the box. Zuma back on the ball. And he'll get it wide here. Nicely done for Rafa. Go. Ball gets in behind Areola though. A big save. Can we get the ball out? And we do. Nicely done. Gets it out wide here for four and alls. Oh, Hinterger goes for the slide tackle, gets beat, and it's going to be in the back of the net, an intercepted pass. Oh, <laughs> we just, oh, we cannot get the ball out. They are really playing us tight, and it's a poor pass there. We go with the slide tackle, trying to be aggressive. We give it up, and it's an easy goal. 1-0 to Villarreal. 
poked away there. Can we get the ball going forward? Traore has to settle it down at his feet. Has Antonio, can he get on the ball? He does, has a chance here. Sends it wide and it's intercepted as we try to get it up to Rafa. Antonio quickly back on it though. We'll have another chance, sends it through. Rafa on the ball, gets behind. He puts it in the back of the net. One all, one all, West Ham are coming a scoring threat here after going in multiple games without scoring. We have at least seemed to find some offense here. A good pass there. Vlasic sneaks it in behind, and that pace is helping. We need just one or two more pieces, and I think this team could be something to compete with. And it's now one to one here against Villarreal. Good ball here for Rafa again. He's going to get behind the back line. Has a chance. Tight angle almost deflects off the defender. And it goes for another corner. Corner here, Cresswell. He'll send a good ball in. High ball in. Headed down and easily caught by the keeper. Good ball there through the middle. Triori through to Antonio. He knocks it down and he has Rafa. Rafa now. On the angle. Can he beat the keeper? No. Deflected away. Almost had him there, though. And that's some dangerous offense here for West Ham as we'll go for another corner. And that will do it. We will go into halftime all even at one. All poked away nicely. Vlasic gets it to Fornals. Slip through the middle here. Has a chance. Triore. Triore just going to be too long as we try to find a go-ahead goal. Intercepted again. Quickly up here. Antonio now. Tries to send it in. Four nulls. Four nulls now. Trying to send it across. Traore has the chance on the angle. Tough one though. Goalkeeper easily gets over there and makes the save. They get inside here. Big shot from, oh, from the top again. I mean, good lord. Can we ever step up a little bit and just try to defend those? We let it go, and it's in the back of the net. 2-1 to Villarreal. We get through here. Oh, we broke it up once, and we gave it... Ah! Oh. The deflection goes in. And it's just on every time. Every time you block something, it always goes right back to them. And then they one-time it into the back of the net. 3-1 Villarreal. Oh, we miss with the interception there, and this is going to be another one. Oh, Ariola comes up with the save finally on a long shot. We actually defended it, and it goes out for a corner. Driving here, they get behind us. Ariola has to make a save. Back into the middle, though. Dangerous. Right back in. Right back into the back of the net. Four to one. And I don't know what we have to do to try and clear these balls, but it's unbelievable. And we'll struggle again. Back into the net, 4-1. We'll just swing and send the ball there. Antonio on it. Can he get the pass there? No, intercepted along the back line. And it's long balls and deflections that do us in. And it's 4-1. to one. And so that will do it for us here. We at least got a victory, but we still sit bottom of the conference here in the east side of the Super League. We take on Man United in the next one. We're going to have to turn things around quickly. We are going to run out of games shortly. I don't know if the playoffs are even going to be possible at this point, but I mean, the team, the team has a good base. It's just we're just missing something. Just a little bit of luck, a little bit of things to go our way. We'll see how things go. If you guys did enjoy it, make sure to hit the subscribe button, turn on notifications so you can always find out when the newest ones come out. And until next time, have a good one.